I have a story to, to share with everybody, uh, a personal story where I actually kind of met Jocko. I'm Robert Trujillo and I play bass in a band called Metallica, but actually I'm here to talk about Jocko Pastorius. He is a bass player. Some would consider him the Jimi Hendrix of bass. Some would say he was the greatest bass player that ever lived. It would have been around 1985 and uh, there was a guitar show called the LA Guitar Show and it was at the Merlin Hotel um, in Hollywood, which is now I think a Holiday Inn Express. And I was in this one room and I heard the building shake. I mean, the windows rattled. There was this huge, huge low end that was coming out of the building. I thought it was an earthquake because the walls were shaking. But it got to the point where, I mean, that whole theory about turning to 11, you're turning the amp to 11, that, that's, this was beyond that. And it got to the point where it was actually scary. So I walked into the next room and it was Jocko. Jocko was sitting there with this, you know, bass guitar rep guy or whatever he was. And uh, he was playing this bass very loud. I was probably the first one in the room and I was just, completely, I, 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 I didn't even know what to say, I was blown away that it was him. And uh, basically sat down about five feet from him. He's just playing, doesn't really acknowledge me. And, uh, and he looks up, he looks at me, but he was, it was like he looked right in my eyes. The room started to fill up within a couple of minutes, the room was packed and everybody's jaw was just, you know, had dropped and he started playing some classic, uh, you know, Jocko bass lines and then some classic R&B lines. He just started mixing it up a bit. He didn't say one word to any, anybody, but he looked everybody in the eye and it was almost like, and he wasn't in the best way possible at that time because it was a, at a time when he was having, having problems. But he uh, looked at everybody almost to say, you know, look, I got you in the palm of my hands, you know. Sometimes I think back and I think, why didn't I like, you know, invite, invite him out for a, a, a burger or something or whatever you know could have hung with him because he seemed like in the right situation you definitely hang with the guy you know you know you to meet your hero like that it was uh, it was pretty awesome <laughs>